always controversial, Greenwood LaFleur lived in two worlds. His mother was the daughter of a great Choctaw chief, his father a Frenchman with a prosperous trading post. LaFleur was disliked by many Choctaws for embracing white culture, yet as a tribal chief he opposed white encroachment on Choctaw lands. However, in 1830, believing the loss of tribal land was inevitable, LaFleur signed the Treaty of Dancing Rabbit Creek. The treaty surrendered 11 million acres to the United States, but allotted land to all Choctaw families that chose to stay, and allowed them to become legal citizens. LaFleur was later elected to Mississippi's House and Senate. Even though he was a cotton planter, a slaveholder, and a personal friend of Jefferson Davis, he opposed the Confederacy. Upon his death in 1865, Greenwood LaFleur was buried in an American flag. This has been Mississippi, a thread through time.